intern Savannah with 107.5 The River. I'm here with Chris from MTV's Guy Code, Carly and Jesse May from MTV's Girl Code. And Guys, Fozzie welcome Bear. to Nashville. Fozzie and Fozzie, this and is their Fozzie's dog. Too. He's from, from Dog Code. From yeah. Dog Code. That, <laughs> that's good. Okay, so I've got a couple questions for you. I don't want to beat a dead horse, but I just have to ask. Miley Cyrus is from Nashville, so we just we love to talk about her around here. Mm -hmm. You guys are at the VMAs. Do you think she broke girl code by twerking all over Robin Thicke? Do you think Robin Thicke broke some kind of guy code because he's married? She broke a lot of codes. She broke, she broke yeah. fire codes that <laughs> night. <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> she broke <laughs> fire codes. Yeah, so many well, codes. I think, yeah. you know... I mean, look, as a guy, I didn't think, I thought Miley Cyrus, I thought it was cool. I mean, you know, I, of course. fine, yeah, but uh, you asked me Robin Thicke, the only thing, he is pants broke guy code. That was, <laughs> you can't come out with the I tightest sure. referee pants <laughs> Why Beetlejuice? ever. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice Beetle pants, but we will say, I think Carly and I, we both were sitting, we had really close seats at the VMAs, yeah. thanks MTV. Um, <laughs> and uh, we saw Miley, like, she was like, we, we the whole arena noticed like it was like whoa she's kind of uh she's going crazy right now yeah, yeah. and it was like a she's... build like we were like what what is going on we're <laughs> yeah. like maybe it's gonna evolve into something and make sense and everyone was just because we yeah. were like right there mm -hmm. it, like she literally we could like smell her ass and <laughs> right. we we're just like this is getting worse and everybody's face was yeah. the same like, and like, also when the cameras weren't rolling she was humping like the yeah. drummer the, really? yeah. Like, yeah. Behind, yeah like she was the, like the song the, was over that, Humping the, the drum set. The drum, that's right, the drum yeah. set. Yeah. Justin Timberlake was on stage and she was just humping the drums, <laughs> just She's going like by crazy. Herself with a microphone. And we were like, yeah. Miley. Her song's over. <sighs> She's still like, going. Miley. Well, yeah. now we've heard something new about it because yeah. all right. everybody was talking about was the twerking, but apparently it was a hell of a lot worse than that's we thought. Weird. And they were shutting the cameras off, remember? Yeah, yeah. yeah they blacked out the screen at the Barclays. They Center. weren't even showing yeah, they like, stopped. The, cam the, the TVs that show people yeah. are sitting far away what's happening. They cut that off. Yeah. People, there was, a, you know, she's, she was, it was like, getting to the point bad where people would have rather just looked at Richard Simmons in the dress. <laughs> Richard Simmons was in a dress walking around and people were like, oh my God, but then Miley was like, you know what, Simmons is better Simmons right is now. Better. Right. Yeah. yeah. Totally. Well, some bragging too. You know, Guy Code is MTV2's like most successful yes. reality show ever. Congratulations. Yeah. How does it feel to be on a show like that? Um, it feels great, you know. Um, it's, uh, it's on MTV2. So, um, you guys, you know, three people watch it. No, I'm joking. No, I'm joking. No, no, no. It's, it's honestly is like, it's amazing to be part of that network's like success. And yeah. I'm so grateful to them because, you know, they like change everything for me. I was able to quit. Um, I, f I was a physical therapist before all this, able to quit that because of all the success um, the show's been getting on MTV2. And it's created so many spin offs right. now that it's like this whole like, Beast that it, like helped your girlfriend get success. It, yeah, yeah, everybody. Right? I mean, yeah, it helped. How's yeah. that for leverage, right? It's well, it's it's funny because it was like here, it was like oh, you know, guy code created. Um, you know, spun off Girl Code and then Girl Code just skyrocketed right, that people exactly. don't even know Guy Code exists anymore. It's like, girls! Well, Girl Code has the strongest social media presence out of any reality yes. show on MTV ever. So do you guys ever just kind of peruse around Twitter and see what's being said and kind of, you know, how does that affect you? Because I'm sure not everyone's nice all the time. Yeah. I haven't, I haven't, yeah. I don't look. I mean, I just, I just At like to make I jokes. Did. At yeah. first I did. I would like look around, but now I'm like, I'm just going to stay where I'm at. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. I just use it for making jokes and having fun. I mean, sometimes yeah. we have to be like, you know, I have the, the mouth that usually people want to put a muzzle on, so, <laughs> but before girl code, I would just, you know, lash, yeah. you know, say whatever, but now it's like, sometimes I kind of put you a cap on it, because, right. yeah. you, you know, the fans are younger, so, but I still, I think, push the line a little bit at yeah. times. Totally. So Twitter's if fun. you had to say, you know, what is the ultimate girl code rule? What's the ultimate guy code rule? What would you guys say? Um, um, I don't know. I think ultimate girl code rule is don't try and be the girl in the magazine. And I say that yeah. all the time. And I just think like we're in a generation where young girls look to these girls in the magazine and girls in photos and all this stuff and they try and be perfect. And I always say the girl in the magazine doesn't even look like the girl in the magazine. Exactly. So just, you know. Yeah, true. Love it. Love what it. What about so, you? I agree with Jesse. Yeah. She said it perfect. <laughs> totally. Chris? Um, well, that was like, it's that was a good answer. Um, <laughs> guy codes. Guy code. so you were going to say that fart. too. Um, <laughs> farting's oh, well, cool. You broke that rule last uh, night. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's guys. Well, no, I mean, yeah. you know, I guess the ultimate... Well, I'm on girl and guy code. Bi code. Um, so I guess. So I guess <laughs> the, ulti curious. the ultimate bi code is yeah. Just let your curiosity take over and just be yourself. Yeah. 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 Somebody in the hallway laughed. Yeah. You're killing him in the hallway, Chris. That's like the coolest rule I've ever heard. Yeah. Okay. Well. Okay. One last question. If you weren't on. 
girl code and guy code, what would you be doing? Jesse. I would be still stalking Stamos, and that was an alliteration. <laughs> no college education, I just did alliteration. You're welcome. No, I would just wow. be working the comedy clubs, yeah. working hard, trying to get something else. I still would be doing what I'm doing when I'm not taping and filming, just doing stand-up So you are kind of living the dream. Basically. Yeah, you know what? It is a cliche, but I do feel like I'm living the dream. Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. What about yeah. you? Uh, if I wasn't doing comedy at all, I would probably still just be... A receptionist <laughs> because I have no education. Girl code's yeah. what I did forever. So thanks again. But for there's nothing wrong with being a receptionist. No. Nothing wrong with being a receptionist. No, I, I did that up until like five minutes you ago. You know, somebody has to answer morning. the phone. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. exactly. Who else is going to answer it? Make if that I'm money. not there, I don't know. This phone's been ringing the whole time. Yeah, it's because yeah. I'm not working. Nobody cares. <laughs> Receptionist because I quit. I'm sorry, you guys. You don't get answer. You can call me because it's me. Yeah, totally. What about you? Me? Um, I'd probably still be. I was a pediatric physical therapist up until like six no months ago. No, I come mean, on. What was that word you were doing? Pediatric much. physical therapist, no, hydrocephalus, bicoat. Hydrocephalus. Um, <laughs> the medical term. Versus Hydrocephalus. Yeah. <laughs> come on, loser. Uh, <laughs> Like no, it's you um, I would probably be doing that, you know. So, which is not a bad job. It was a gratifying position. I love doing that. But this is my dream. I mean, we talk about it all the time. How like we can't believe like this is our job right now. <laughs> like we're on yeah. the radio and we get yeah, to really cool. be funny at night and see a town we've never seen, Nashville, and it's a blessing. Yeah, thanks MTV too, <laughs> and MTV and everyone else and Fozzy. Yeah, especially <laughs> special thanks to Fozzie. We owe it all to Fozzie. Fozzie's yeah. really been there for Fozzie us. Fozzie did our auditions and everything. Stop it, guys. Yeah, look at his tongue Stop, Stop, it. Him. Stop it, guys. Stop it. Get the camera out of my face. Well, you guys, thank you so much for hanging out with us. Nashville, they're going to be at Zany's tonight, Saturday, and Sunday. Go to, uh, I think it's zanies.nashville.com for ticket information. I believe tickets are $20. It's going to be a great show. Go out and see them. Come out and say hi. Thank we'll you. be there afterwards. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Give it up for Savannah's baby. Savannah's yeah, baby. Give it up, Give it up for the baby. the baby. Give it up for pregnancy yeah. brain. We're doing it. My dog here. put his paw on your belly. I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, it's okay. <laughs>